All right, what's up everyone? I get asked a lot about these frame swaps. I have other videos that tell you basically what you need in regards of the chassis to put underneath. I'm not sure if these work on one tons or not. The bed's probably different. I imagine the front fenders might be different. The cabs, I believe, are the same. But don't quote me. I don't come in contact with half, you know, one ton. These are all half ton trucks that I get there pretty much complete with the beds. So, I don't know what more I can answer on the frame swaps. Here's another one I'm doing. I lowered it down quite a bit more than my last one. I need to go through the wiring and clean it up. I'm going to use the powered bucket seats. I am obviously going to put new floors in it, transmission tunnel, but I'm getting a lot of my stuff mocked up. I'm going to fill up all the holes in the dash that I don't need anymore and that people put in the dash throughout its lifetime. Um, <clears throat> I don't know. You'll see updates. I'll post more of that. I'm getting ready to pull an LS out of here. I should not be showing a Chevy engine on a Ford video, but it is what it is. I love it all. But I don't put Chevys in Fords. I will if you want me to, but I personally don't. I rock everything Ford. Ford, 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 or Chevy, 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 Chevy. If you want a Frankenstein, I'll make a Frankenstein. But coming right along. <laughs> 